All right, what is going on, guys? Today I have a quick lineup video. As you have to come to a lineup video too, I'm going to as well. Uh, I'm just gonna go over my team real quick. I have a, I have a pretty much all goal team. I had Antonio Brown. I got for free. Uh, I didn't mean to get the deluxe edition, but I did. And so let's look at my team. It's probably one of the best goal lineups I can dream up. First, Ryan Tannehill. Guys got for about 9k. Saw came in for 5k. Sniped that. Never, never bought a card so quick. Sold him for about uh, 18, I think. Made a nice profit. Then bought this Tannehill for about 9k or like 8k. I like this Tannehill. Good speed. Good throw power. Good throw accuracy. Besides throw deep and good throw on the run. One of the best budget quarterbacks right now, if you ask me. Then here we go. The bowling ball. Jeremy Hill. 88 speed, 85 agility, 90 excel. Just a well-balanced back with 76 catching as well. And he up like 81 carry. Fumbling is not an issue in this game. He has not fumbled for me at all. And solo challenges or online. The first year Antonio Brown, the card I got for free. Uh, you know, nothing to say about him really. Next you got Doug Baldwin, one of my favorite budget cards. This dude in my slot, 87 speed, but like what does he have? 90 excel, 92 agility, so he's, you know, shifty. 88 catch, 86 elusiveness, 88 spec catch, bad release, but he's in the slot for a reason. 88 route running and 90 catch in traffic. Love that guy in my slot. Next you have Emmanuel Sanders, and I really like this receiver too. 88 speed, 92 catch, 88 elusiveness, 92 spec catch, 76 release. Kind of low, but got to deal with it. 90 route running, 86 catch in traffic, and 91 jump. There's a lot of 90s on this card for an 83 overall. And guys, I'm going to say I like every card, because like every card in my lineup I have for a reason. I don't have, I don't have any cards that just are just sitting there waiting to be replaced. But next we have Jake Long, this guy, well balanced, 95 strength, you know, bad speed kind of, but 77 excel, 85 run block, 86 pass block, and 87 impact block. Like his versatility and how balanced he is. Next we got Matt Lawson, picked up this guy today, 91 strength, 84 awareness, you know, not athletic really, but decent excel. And, you know, 89 run block, kind of bad pass block, but 82 impact block. I like his run blocking and his pass blocking is not, you know, horrible, horrible. And next, I used to have that Zuda card who was an excellent run blocker but lacked in the pass blocking. He had like 73 pass block. And this guy is definitely an upgrade. Mike Pouncey, 88 strength, you know, 78 excel, 87 run block, 81 pass block, 94 impact block. Kind of like a rock in the middle of my line. And here's one of my few 79s or less than 80s. But this guy is worth it. 88 strength, 76 awareness for like a second year player. But he has 77 excel, 85 run block, 93 pass block, at 78 impact block. You know, I can wait. Guards are kind of expensive, but I have a bid on a Kyle Long right now. And maybe if I get that, I'll definitely uh, accept that upgrade. But until then, I'll take this Brandon Linder on the Jags. Now we got Marcus Gilbert. I, I got this guy for about 2,000, so I just, I just couldn't resist upgrading. You know, great strength, 91 strength, 79 awareness. You know, kind of bad. He's not really fast or shifty at all. But he has 84 run block, 85 pass block, and 86 impact block. Not bad. And then if you have Charles Clay, he's my new starter. 80 speed, I'll get to that in a second. 74 run block is great. 88 catching. 78 route running is not, you know, it's not too shabby. 86 catch in traffic and no spec catch, pretty much. 77. You know, 80 speed, but 81 at Jody and 89 XL. It's way better than 80 speed if you, like, it feels like a lot faster than 80 speed. Now onto my defense. Every position besides my defensive tackle. Oh, I, I got to replace him for this slot corner. Let me put him in here real quick. This is Norris Jenkins. I got him for about 600 coins. You know, whatever. I'll take that steal. Um, loading. Oh, the loading screens are so long in this game. Next, we got Greg Hardy at right end. This guy's dominant for me in the right end position. He does really good. I had Feller Jr., but this guy, you could tell he's stronger. He holds down the left tackle. 76 speed, 86 strength, 86, 86 strength, 83 excel, 84 tackle, 82 block shot, 94 power move, 77 play rec. There's not a lot of DNs like him. Some of them will be like really fast, but have like... You know, 83 power move and like nothing else. It's kind of bad. But Greg Hardy, one of the best balanced right ends in the game right now. Now, my defensive tackles are the one position I'm trying to upgrade. And But this Quan short will get the job done. 68 speed, 86 strength, 84 tackle, 80 block shot, 87 power move. Bad play rec, 84 pursuit. You know, not bad. Now, next we got Limbaugh Joseph. More like the nose tackle. We're not really fast, but just like go shut down the line. He got 68 speed too, but 95 strength. 88 tackle, 88 block shed, 82 power move. All the D tackles have bad power move for some reason. I don't know why. 77 player and 86 pursuit. He has 79 XL. Short has 85 XL. Next, I got a real nice deal on this guy. I saw him for about 1500, so I just got him. He has 80 speed, 80 strength, 87 XL, 83 tackle, 73 block shed, 93 finesse move, and 78 play rec. Just a speed rusher, pretty much. Pretty fast off the edge. I will take it. 
Next man, right outside linebacker. I got this guy for free out of some pack. Uh, but one of the best linebackers in the game right now, right outside. You know, 77 speed, a little slow, but 80 strength, 83 excel, 91 tackle, 87 play rec. That's huge. 87 block shot is huge too. 96 pursuit and 96 hit power. He also has 80 something zone, which I really appreciate. Next, we have one of the best budget middle linebackers in the game. 82 speed. Brandon Marshall, 82 awareness, 88 tackle, 83 play rec, 78 block shot, 93 pursuit, 88 zone, 79 power move, and what is his catch again? 66 catch, that's pretty good right now. And here's another budget beast, Brad Ham of the Bills, 86 speed, 73 strength, you know, not a great strength guy, but 87 excel, 88 tackle, 77 play rec, 81 block shed, 93 pursuit, 91 hit power, and he also has 80 something zone. All my linebackers are in the 80s with zone, I love it. And here's one of my other under 80 cards, Lewis Delmas, not bad. He compares really well to that 81 Malcolm Jenkins, who I almost got, but, you know, I'm not gonna. 84 speed, 91 excel, 78 play rec, bad tackle, but 85 zone, you know, 72 pursuit and 82 hit power, not bad at all. 91 excel is huge, and he has 73 catch. I might upgrade him, though, but next you have Denoris Cersei, down with the Titans this offseason, 86 speed, 86 excel, 74 play rec, 78 tackle, 80 zone, 82 pursuit, and... 75 pursuit, you know, just a balanced, strong safety, you know, is it going to be flashy, but we'll just, you know, get the job done. Now I got this demon owner for free as well. He has 92 speed, 93 excel, 88 agility, 81 man, 86 zone, not a bad, not a big deal, I run a lot of zone. 85 press, 76 play rick, and 69 catch, and he's 6 foot, gotta love that. And in my slot we have Jenkins, as I said, just picked up for 700 coins. He has 89 speed, 90 excel, 93 agility, 85 man, 80 zone. 70 press, 73 play rec, and 73 catch. For 700 coins, I can do a lot, a lot worse. Now this guy is, I got Sam Shields. You know, this guy's pretty fast. 91 speed, but 86 excel, 86 agility. Kind of got uh, screwed on that, but 84 man, 86 zone. Bad press, of course. 76 play rec, and 66 catch. And that is my lineup, guys. I have an 82 overall, as you can see. I got 37,000 coins, but I got two bids on for like 10,000 coins. So I should be at like 47,000 coins. So yeah, let me know what you guys think of my team. Uh, leave any suggestions down below. Uh, subscribe to the channel for more Madden 16 content. Uh, and like the video. And I will catch you guys on the next one.